The Chaos Perico heist, but the wheel decides how we have to do absolutely everything from the entry vehicle to how we have to escape from what weapon we have to use to the compound entry, the compound exit. Absolutely everything is decided by the wheel. So this is a series that I've been doing almost, I feel like since I started this channel last year. It's um, it's something that I really love doing. I love doing the KO Perico heist, as you guys know. I love to spin the wheel because it makes it just so spontaneous and I have no idea what's going to happen. And it's just some fun entertainment for you. Who doesn't love the KO Perico, man? So anyway, without further ado, let's get this wheel rolling and start up our picking of how we have to do everything. All right, guys. So for our first wheel, since this one is actually still here from last time, uh, as you can see right here, this is disguise or no disguise. One of the most important ones because this will make it either incredibly easy or possibly incredibly difficult to spend in on what the rest of these wheels have to say. Let's go ahead, spin this wheel. I really want it to be disguised. I want it to be disguised. Of course not. Why wouldn't Why would it listen to anything I have to say? 50-50 chance, man. <laughs> Let's carry on to the next one. Okay, so next up, we have the vehicle. So this is the vehicle... Oh, basically how we get into the island. Is it going to be the patrol boat, the Annihilator, Vellum, Alcanist, Kasaka, or Longfin? Is that the other one? Alcanist. Do Alcanist. Do Alcanist. Do Alcanist. <laughs> Listen, I just, I say I haven't done it in a while. Didn't we do this literally last time I did this? I love the Alcanist. The Kasaka would have been great too, though, because that would have made my life a little... Listen, we're doing Alcanist. We can't not listen to the wheel. All right, next up, guys. This is where we have to drop, right? So we know we're coming in with the Alcanist now. The little Alcanist. So where are we going to jump out? Where are we going to land? So let me explain what all of these are. So we have the South Drop. Which obviously, if you do the Annihilator, you can choose the north or south drop. It's where the helicopter comes in. So we can jump out and fly on over to the south drop. We also have the north drop, which is the same thing, just up the north. We have the airstrip we can jump into, the north dock, the main dock, the west beach. And then these two, which may be confusing if you haven't watched my series before, we have the farm and the mid map. So the mid map is the one... Let me actually throw up. There's a map right here. So this is the mid map. It's kind of just right next to like the main dock, but it's like, it's mid map. It's its own little section. And this right here, this is the farm, right? This is what I call the farm. So there you have it. You know what all of these drop points are. Let's go ahead. Which one do I want before we spin it? You may ask. Honestly, we're jumping out. We're not getting it. We're not allowed a disguise. So I don't want to go. So the airstrip is always easy. Let's be honest. The airstrip's an easy one. I haven't done the main dock. It feels like in feels like a year, but it's probably been months since I've done the main dock. Same thing with the north dock. Um, I think this north and south drop would kind of suck. Mid map would be fun and farm would be fun. Farm or mid map, I would prefer. Just, just for the sake, I haven't done it in a while. It would be fun. All right, what are we thinking? Oh. Listen, I said I haven't done it in a while. I didn't say it was easy. The main dock is actually brutal. Without getting a disguise, it's it's a rough one. Anyway, main dock it is. All right, so next up, we have our weapon. This is what weapon that we are going to be using. Now, realistically, I don't know why I keep skipping, by the way. Realistically, I would... It doesn't really matter because I don't plan on shooting anyone. But in the case that something does hit the fan, you know what I mean? Uh, I would... Marksman is incredible. Aggress is incredible. The other three... You know, they're all, you know, the crack shot isn't great, let's be honest. But we're not getting crack shot. It was one of the two I said I liked. Why is it skipping? I didn't press anything, I promise. Okay, aggressor. It, it, it's probably the best one you can get, to be honest. So I'll take it. All right, guys. So this is for the entry, the compound entry, right? We already know our entry when we jump out is going to be the main dock where we need to go to. This is going to be the entry for the compound. So let's go ahead and spin it. We have the main gate, which means we'd have to blow it up. We have the north wall, south wall, which means we need grappling hooks. We have the gates, which means we're going to need to kill people to get a key code. And I can see it's bloody stopped on gates. Um, <laughs> the drainage. It's gates. Okay. <sighs> this is going to be a fun one. Yeah. No, it is. This, this is going to be. This is going to be challenging. All right. And last but not least, we have our escape. So once we've finished in the compound, we've got all our secondary loot. We've got everything. Do we escape the north dock, which means we'd have to travel all the way up north, grab a boat, and then leave? 
Do we leave the main dock, which is going back to the same way we came in, but we have to get a boat and leave? Do we go the airstrip, which means we're going to have to take out the air support and fly out of there? Or the easiest, which is good that it's green, is the bottom map, where we literally just jump off the bottom map and it will take us seconds. Let's spin and see what bottom map is clearly what I would prefer. Worst case, if it's not bottom, I would prefer the main dock. I'll take it. I listen, I'm ecstatic. You guys are the ones at home like, screw this stupid things rigs, man. I know you want to see me suffer. Listen, there's also a few uh, wheel spins that haven't weren't in this. We have a lot of other wheel spins we can add. Let me know if there's any wheel spins that we've had in the past or any for the future that you would like. Is there anything you would like to add to these wheel spins to spice it up a little bit? There's a lot we've had and tested in the past. Some of them you like, some of them you didn't like. For example, we've had wheels where it says, do we get our loot, our secondary loot before the compound or after the compound? We've had disruption wheels, which says, you know, disruption. Do you do disruption missions or do you do not do the disruption missions? That's been on there. We've had secondary loot location. So where we have to go to get secondary loot. We've had secondary loot type where you have to get a specific type of secondary loot. So we've got to go around the entire map looking for something in particular. We've had the day night spin the wheels. We've had a lot and there's probably some that you want me to add or some to take away. Let me know in the comment section down below out of all those ones I just said or any of those ones you want me to add for next week. Is there any that we've done you want taken away or is there one some new things that I haven't even mentioned here today that you would like to add as well? Let me know in the comment section down below. All right, guys, so what is going to happen now? I'm going to go ahead and set this thing up the way that it is requested. I set it up, obviously, having the Alchemist as our entry vehicle. That's going to be the most difficult, but um, I'm just going to set all of these up. It should take me about 30 minutes, and then I'm going to come back to you guys right when we're starting up this heist. So let's do it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's official. I have set everything up exactly how the wheel has told me to do it. So let's go ahead and take a little sneak peek here. So as far as prep work, we obviously got the Alcanist because we're going to be dropping in uh, equipment. I mean, that's just normal stuff and weapon loadout, the aggressor. So let's just go ahead and start this thing up and set it all up, shall we? Purchase heavy armor, sure. I don't have snacks and armor. I always say that. I'm not planning on getting any snacks or armor. I'm oh, being shot at, okay? So we need to jump into the main dock and then we need to go from the main dock... All right, let's just do it here. So we got to jump Alcanus, and then we're coming in. Halo jump, and we're going to go to the main dock. That's what the wheels said. Uh, compound entry point will say drainage, but they actually wanted us to go. Which one was it? North wall? It was a gate. Was it North gate or South gate? Let me check. It was South gate. South gate. So our escape, we're going to say main dock, but it was actually ball map. We got very lucky on this one. Uh, and then daytime, we could do a wheel for that. Let me know where well, I took it away because I feel like it's just better to see these things in the daytime. Uh, weapon loadout, we have the aggressor, as you can see right there. And that's it. That is everything for this one. I have a feeling this is going to be pretty easy. You know, we're going to jump out to the main dock, get all our loot at the main dock. If we don't have all of our loot at the main dock, we're going to have to venture out and get more loot somewhere else. Um, but that's it. And then we're just going to go to the compound. I'm going to have to kill people, though, because we're going to have to drive to the compound or sneak to it. And then we need to take some people out at the compound entrance. We need to get the gate key code. Make sure no guards trigger the alarm. And then we have to go all the way to the back end to the south gate. So this one is going to be... It is... It's not going to be as that... It's not going to be that difficult, but it's not going to be that easy too. This is like an intermediate, I would say. Anyway, let's jump into this bloody heist, shall we? All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I also put on a nice little yellow outfit because I can't remember... I don't remember seeing the yellow one. We're using the yellow one. It looked cool. It was bright, all right? All right. <laughs> anyway... Um, so this is going to take us a while, but let me show you while we're flying over there what the plan is here. So we're going to jump out, land right down here. Then we're going to walk down here and get our loot. Wait, no, the loot's going to be inside here. I'm hoping we can get all the loot from inside this building, by the way. If not, we're going to have to make our way up here and get loot out of this building. Now, if there's no loot or not enough to fill my bag out of these two, from here, we're going to have to make our way across the river and maybe up to this building, or we could. Listen, I'm not planning on doing that, okay? But our plan is to get the loot from the, the main dock. If we get it from the main dock, we're going to be coming up this way here, hugging along this wall, take out this camera, take out this guard. Are we jumping yet? Nope, still got miles to go. 
uh, take out the guard here and the camera here and then there's gonna be two guards right here now hopefully one of these three people we take out here will drop the key but we need to keep an eye on a jeep that's going to be driving around this area here because if that jeep comes up here sees those bodies alarms triggered so we're gonna to have to take these people out come this way and then run straight down here to this gate and go through there probably have to kill a few people on the way there too anyway let's go ahead and jump out we were you know the the plane looked miles away okay and then i i started looking at my thing and anyway i i just hope we get the elite challenge i just hope we get the elite challenge all right you know what we'll just land oh no bloody hell we almost that could have made this an absolute disaster can you imagine if we would have just gone off that cliff right there then oh my days okay where am i a little disoriented okay perfect we're back on target okay so i'm hoping inside of here camera please don't turn right this second all right let's just go right around this corner Whoop. please i was hoping there was going to be two stacks of coca-cola right there instead we got absolutely nothing absolutely nothing ah this is the worst case scenario what's happening right now this is worst case scenario oh my god what did that guard just scare the life out of me too i was watching my mini map and he just turned towards me this is worst case scenario because we're gonna have to take out these two people up here there is most likely going to be a guard that's going to drive past around here and i have a feeling hold on i have a feeling there's not we need there has to be two stacks of coca-cola in here there's not nothing there's no way there is nothing in here there's a little little stack of grass a tiny stack of grass and that camera you see that camera by the way i always trigger the alarm when that camera's here See how it comes across right here for some reason i always trigger the alarm from that camera when i'm looting we're going to attempt it oh my god and those two i'm sorry i'm being quiet this is a disaster this is a disaster there's gonna be a car that drives by here and i've just taken two people out now do we wait for this car to come because I'm going to have to take out the driver. Oh, God. I'm going to have to take out the driver. Because the car's either going to come down here or there's going to be one that drives down here and wraps around. But I need more secondary loot. We're not getting the elite challenge. That is for bloody sure. All right. We're going to have... Okay, there's got to be a motorcycle here or something, right? Where's the Jeeps? Where's the motorcycles? This is bloody awful. Okay, we're just going to run. We're going to run. I'm going to hope a Jeep doesn't come along that road right there. And we're just going to run. Oh, my days. There's this guy up here, too. Please let me take you out. Don't move, please. He deserved that. He deserved that. Okay, we're just going to go and see if we can get more loot over here. I'm not looking forward to this because I'm 90. Do you like my yellow little jacket, by the way? Uh, I'm not looking forward to this because I just feel like... Oh, God. Where's this guard? He's looking at me. Where are you? No, you're going. You're going. You guys, this is a disaster. This is a disaster! The worst case scenario is a truck drives past. And the other annoying thing is I can't... I would love to take that truck. Grab a disguise, take that truck. Unfortunately, what do we got? We got Coca-Cola. This isn't going to fill up our thing either. This is a disaster. It's been a while since I've had one this bad. How did that guard... How was that guard... You know what? It was inevitable. It was absolutely bloody inevitable. This has been the worst... 
KO Perico eyes I think I've ever had in my life. First of all, no loot at the main dock. What the hell is that? No bloody loot. And then you give me all of this absolute rubbish. Okay? What is happening? This is freaking awful. And I, we have no disruption missions. You can get behind there. Pop your head up. Pop it up again one more time. A death. Oh my god. I didn't get snacks or armor. I have no body armor available. <sighs> We're going. We're just going to run. We're going to run. We're going to run. This is freaking awful. <laughs> this is so bad. This is so bad. You climb up this stupid... We're going to the farm, by the way, if you hadn't noticed. First of all, there's no reason whatsoever that guard should have seen me. I don't think... Did I... Unless I accidentally, and by accidentally, I mean stupidly, started opening up, like using the blowtorch on the door. I don't think I did, to be completely honest with you. I don't think that's what I did. But if I did do that, then okay, that's why I triggered the alarm. But if I didn't do that, and we just triggered that alarm for doing absolutely nothing, I'm fuming. All right, you just, you go bye bye. What have we got here? So this is the farm, by the way, that I was talking about at the beginning. Uh, we got more grass and some cat. This is a stinker. This is an absolute stinker. I don't think we're even completing this heist, to be completely honest with you. Obviously, we're not getting the elite challenge. But uh, this is... This is the definition of a stinker. All right, where are you? Just go away. How about you don't... Take away all of my health and armor. Where is this guy? This guy. No, no, no. I'm not running away from this guy until he's dead. This guy is... We're not leaving until this guy's dead. Are you, are you sure he's dead? Okay. Ha! Like, no. This, uh, <laughs> guys, I'm having an awful time. I'm having an awful time. I'm having a stinker. Listen, you. We're going to shoot you? Okay. Don't die. I'm in a bad mood now. I'm in a bloody awful mood. This is... You know what? We've got quite a few snacks. Not enough. Not enough. Let's be clear here. Uh, we have the Juggernaut, which we're going to be coming up against here soon. Um, but we have snacks. We have a little bit of snacks. Don't you shoot me. What gun are you shooting me with? That Did you have a mini gun up there in your little watchtower? Get out of here. Oh my god. The thing is, we still need to get a gate code. So I'm going to have to shoot some people down here at the compound just to get this gate code. Uh, oh no. I've crashed. I've gone and crashed. All right, let's just do this. Let's take our. Nah. 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 Because why is there so many people? All right, he doesn't. You know what? Let's just get in here. No, no, no. <laughs> no! We're going this way. Listen, who am I running over? You better have the gate key. You. Of who jumps out of the... We're, we're playing against actual ninjas, ladies and gentlemen. I've never seen so many guards here in my life. All right. You. There's no way none of these have dropped it, right? There's no way none of these have dropped the key card. You. Where are you? Come here. Come here, random NPC of a person. You don't have a gate key code either? Why would you? You know what I mean? Why bloody would you? This is awful. Okay, excuse me, sir. No, we're not doing this. We're not doing this. Where is the people with the gate key codes? You know what I mean? Where are you? Excuse me, sir. Listen, I know you're an NPC that's just spawning here. But you're here. And you're freaking the Hulk as well. Like, how's he not dying then? <sighs> One of my least favorite things... I wish we had the bloody... One of my least favorite things about the KO Perico heist is the unlimited spawns of these guys. You know what I mean? You. The unlimited spawns of helicopters. Like, there's no way you just don't run out of helicopters. There's no way you can just have unlimited supply. You know, maybe two or three. You know what I mean? Maybe we have four rounds even. No, these guys are like unlimited supply. 
All right, guys, listen. I need to get a gate key code, and none of them... Uh, no, none of them are dropping the gate key code, so we may have to go closer to the front door to find some more people that have a gate key code. Let me just take this guy out again for the 300,000th time. Uh, we're running out of ammo, which is always, you know, a great thing when you're at KO Perico about to go up against a freaking juggernaut. All right, you're dead. Oh, he's dropped it. Thank you. What is that what you want from me? Is that what you wanted me to be? Like, you just wanted me to have some manners? Jesus Louise, man. We've got no... And we're coming in over here, by the way. It, I don't know where the jug's going to be. All I know is this is a disaster. I feel confident because we are the KO Perico King. Okay? We are the best. Let's keep telling ourselves this. But this is awful. This is awful. Everything has gone wrong in this. We still have a life, though. Keep in mind. I mean, technically, we have one more life. So we can die and still complete it. Usually, I wouldn't want to die, but that's because of the Elite Challenge. But we're not getting the bloody Elite Challenge anyway. Okay. We're going this way. You know what? Where's this jug? No, no, no. You know what? I need that key. And the jug is right here. Oh, my God. I can feel the juggernaut. Like, look at him on the minimap. We all... Oh, God. We're going to die right here. All these guns shooting at me. Oh, none of them hit. One of them hit. Two of them hit. You know what? Just, just bugger off. Hopefully, the jug gets stuck down there. I'm feeling pretty confident. I'm not going to lie. We've also got the key code. Well, not the key code, but the keys. So, I'm trying to think now. Okay. Let's think how to get out of here. Do we go downstairs and out? There's going to be a lot of guards there, though. There's always guards spawning, like a million of them. All right, anyway, let me do this real quick. All right, guys, so I've been thinking while I was doing that. You may have saw the incredible concentration on my face. We're not going to use the key to come out on the bottom level. And the reason for that is down here, there is constantly guards that are going to be just spawning and spawning and spawning, as you'll see right here. Um, there's going to be just constant guard spawn. We got the ruby necklace, by the way. I was talking about how we... I haven't had this in a while. Uh, we got it. But anyway, now that we've taken that out, we're going to have to take out another one right now. All right. Now, let's just reload. Look how many bullets we have. This is fantastic. Um, so, if we go down, though, there's going to be tons of guards that are going to keep spawning down there. And then even when you come out the door down there, there's going to be guards chasing you out. Like, basically, you're going to be like a sitting duck. You can be just hanging out a little, a little old you at the bottom. But if we go back upstairs, we can... I think it'll be better, is basically what I'm trying to say. We're going to have to sprint. We're going to have to sprint. Hold on. We're going to have to sprint because we don't have a lot of bullets. You know what? Why aren't I using this? Let's switch to this, right? This can. This is a jug killer right here. Okay. Let's keep an eye. Where is the juggernaut? Okay, he's down below. Like, he's beneath us. That is exactly what we want. Because we're going to go out the gate that's right here. Right here. Oh, no. What snacks? What? Oh, God. Everyone be quiet. We don't have lots of snacks left. That worked. That, that went exactly as I wanted it to. Big brain. <laughs> no, that went exactly as I wanted it to, man. Oh, this is a disaster, but it's fun, right? If this was just... If we... If we, we could have done this with our eyes closed, right? I mean, I say that. Not really. But we, we could have done this really well. Okay, there's going to be... Who do we go for first? We'll go for you. No. Come on. Come on. Eat some snacks. Eat, eat, eat. Okay, run to the motorcycle as fast as your little legs will carry you. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. On the motorcycle. Okay. Now, let's go to this. Let's go to health and ammo. Let's just turn here. 
Uh, let's go snacks here. What do we have? We have drinks, which we don't want. We have Sprunk, right? Isn't that the only thing we have available right now? Okay, and this is the way. Luckily for us, thank the 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 wheel, the wheel spin Jesus. Uh, this is our this is our escape. Okay, this is our escape. This is it. This is the only. This is what the wheel said to do. Basically, is what I'm trying to say. Sorry, my brain is running at a million miles an hour right here. Uh, the wheel said bottom map. Now, if the wheel would have had us go the main dock as our escape, we wouldn't have made it. Anywhere else other than the bottom map, we would not have made this. Because we just wouldn't have survived. I don't have enough snacks left. We've done it, though. We've absolutely done it. We've bloody done it. Oh, man. Please don't tell me this has been patched. I know it hasn't. There's no way this has been patched. Come on. Finish. It used to be you'd have to go... There we go. Ladies and gentlemen. That went as well as it could have gone. I think under the circumstances, we had... The main dock had no loot. <laughs> what was up with the main dock? And then how did that bloody guy see me through the wall? I knew in my head, by the way, there was a slight second, and I'm not joking right now, when I was like, you should kill that guard behind before you go in here. Just take him out first. And it was there for a second. And then it, I just went for it. That, that thought was in and out of my head faster than anything, okay? But we, we did it. We absolutely did it. Let's see exactly how much money we got. The hair in my eyes, I mean, Let's see how much money got up because I just wasn't paying attention right there as that was going through. Come on, cheers to you. Bada bing, bada boom. Mm -mm. No, nothing in there. Great. Okay, come on. How much did I get? 900. 934,000. Okay, and it took us 16 minutes, so we wouldn't have got the Elite Challenge anyway. But technically, we would have been even faster than that if it wasn't for trying to lose all the guards. And the fact that we had to go around the entire map looking for loot like what an absolute hot stinker good eye mate what an absolute bloody stinker listen i'll tell you what though i had an incredible that was tons of fun it's just a lot you know the adrenaline's pumping i can't believe how there was no loot there though the main i can't believe we had to go all the way up to the farm for loot that is awful what a sh show you know what i mean my god anyway i hope you guys enjoyed my suffering uh <laughs> i hope you guys have had a fantastic weekend and i'll see you guys as always tomorrow with a brand new video goodbye